Welcome at Singapore Corner. Thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah. You have a really good place, sir. Thank you so much. Yeah. And you appreciate it. Yeah. And you're most welcome. Thank you for coming. Yeah. Uh, this is a bookstore. Uh, uh, right now you're just seeing that it's empty. Yeah. It's because we used to take them. Mm. We put on the tables. And, uh, yeah. Uh, so that our clients who came in the last rooms, when yeah. he or she is interested in reading, yeah. he can just try to read some yeah. interesting books that we have here uh, uh, as a bookstore. So can someone come here and uh, maybe rent a book or, or is it just for the clients? Uh, we have two types. Uh -huh. uh, th there are some clients who came yeah. uh, and make an exchange. Yeah. He came with one book and he took one, what he chose yeah. to, to read. That's but actually some, a great yeah, idea. Yeah. yeah, but sometimes we have another kind of books that yeah. we used to sell. We are uh, uh, publishing house yeah. in Rwanda. Uh, uh, when we check out to keep moving, we just see that there is some books for sale. Uh, for right okay. now, there's uh, some books here. Someone can come and read. And when, while he's enjoying the coffee, yeah. he can just also have a book to read. Yeah, so Inga Wokona is not just a restaurant. It's a uh, it's a restaurant and creative space. Creative space. Uh, That's, but uh, but the main business is a restaurant. But I, I just want to attract my clients mm. by creativity. Okay. Uh, it's uh, a space where I invite everyone who is creative. Mm. Never feels. Yes. I, I, I like the environment. It's thank really, you so much. Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah. You see the that's the space we use. Uh, to teach, mm -hmm. when you are just you see on the entrance, you saw the art pieces. Yes, uh, that's not where we limit ourselves. We mm. even teach people how to make paintings, mm. how to draw. Uh, we have a program that we used to have on Sunday that is called Ingabo, mm -hmm. uh, Ingabo Next Generation Day. Uh. Uh, we used to invite parents with their kids. They learn, you know, everyone is an artist, yes. but in a different field. Yeah. So. Yeah, so you mean I can be the next generation of... Yeah, big time, big time. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. You know, everyone have a talent. The, yeah. the best way to discover it yeah. is just being around with people who are so talented. Yeah, yeah, yeah That's definitely. why you see people are coming here to make paintings, uh, big books. Yeah, yeah. That's, uh, that's, that's calling me because... Uh, <laughs> You know, my, my middle name is Ngabo, so... Ah, you know, yeah. I appreciate it. My uh, also yeah. name is King Ngabo. Ah. And it's yeah. a pleasure to meet <laughs> yes. you. Uh, uh, as you check yeah. out, that mm -hmm. the space, sometimes when people came to make discussion, having a fun, mm -hmm. it's a fireplace. Yes. Oh, uh, yeah, there's a fireplace. Yeah, it's a fireplace. Ah. That's really innovative and creative. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Thank you so much. Yes. So are you still having the program of... Uh, the Sunday program? Exactly. Okay. Like... Yesterday we had a poetry night. Uh -huh. We had a very talented young ladies, and uh, next week, every week, mm -hmm. uh, we will be having young generation with a creative mind, mm -hmm. having a fun, in, yes. in whatever they are just feel free to express themselves. This is a platform mm -hmm. for those young people also who are so talented. Not only yes. young people, but yeah. also the old people mm. who have never yet discovered their talents. Yeah, it's never too late. Yeah, it's huh? never too late for everyone. Yeah, to discover exactly. yourself. Exactly. Yeah. Mm. So we have the restaurant here. Yes. yes. Uh, what can you tell us about the restaurant? So I started making, when you see the restaurant, the setup, mm -hmm. it shows the simplicity of creativity. And yes. creativity yes. is an intelligence of one person that is having a fun. Yeah. You understand? Yeah. Whatever we can do, we have to make creativity mind, the creative mind. Yes. I hope you understand. I'm yeah, I, 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 I'm trying to understand. Yeah, I'm trying to understand. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. You know, when you're just doing things, you have to be creative. Yeah, definitely. Uh, that's why you are just seeing the space. Mm. It's very simple. Yeah. Uh, but uh, it shows how the man who said it think yeah. in a creative way. Yeah. Uh, you know, when someone says feel at home, mm -hmm. I'm already feeling at home. Exactly. You know? exactly. Yeah. So yeah, it's a it's a really good place because I can I can see how someone can come here to work from here. They can come here for fun. Yeah, exactly. There is really not uh, not a limitation to what you can yeah, do here. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, this is a space for everyone. Yeah. When you check out about the billboard, you're just seeing mm. it's a restaurant, creative and community. Yes. yes everyone definitely. is welcome. Yes. This is an intellectual space. Oh. Everyone who is intellectual must have come. And have a fun. Yeah, never fail. Yeah, yeah. You see, even there, there is a 
uh, a bit of a projection. Mm -hmm. Sometimes we used to have movie nights, yeah. uh, but due to COVID distractions, our, yeah, uh, okay. we used to stop it for right now. But we used yeah. to have a movie night, and yeah. have fun in different fields yeah. that can just improve the yeah. mindset and the yeah. way of thinking. Yeah, hopefully everything will settle and we'll get back to to watching movies from here. Yeah, exactly. Uh, yeah, I'm just becoming you. Yeah, you, thank you, you so already much. Got the pre thank ticket. you so much. Yeah, yeah. I will be happy yeah. to have you, my yes. friend. Yes. Um, yeah. When did you start operating in the first place? I started in uh, April last year, mm -hmm. uh, 2021. Mm. It was not easy, actually. It was yeah. not easy, but we tried to to do something. Even if it's not easy, we just keep striving. Yeah. You can't escape the country. You can no way you can just yeah, run. Yeah, you have definitely. to stay here and make your country beautiful, no matter how situation mm. seems to be. Yeah. What's your uh, method of surviving during this COVID time? Creativity. Yes. Creativity. Yes. Just make things that people don't expect. Don't expect, mm. or, or don't even know that should be the way of make money and, and a business. Yeah, that's uh, yeah. Yeah, that should that yeah. that should be one of the motto. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Sometimes we used to have mm. life painter. Mm -hmm. When someone like a client here came, mm. the electric they are going to paint your first life, your portrait life. Oh. So sometimes people become so attractive. Yeah. 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 So when we have a book sessions reading, yeah. when we are just buying the author for the mm. books. It's something that's so interesting that yeah. people who are here in Kigali are not expecting. Yes. You know, mostly when they go in cafe or somewhere in coffee shop restaurants, mm. what they expect, mm. maybe drink, yeah. having a fun, meeting yeah. some other friends. But also here, we are, we are just meeting with friends and yeah. meeting with intellectual capacity. Yeah. There are intellectual activities that can just uplift yeah. our mindset. Definitely. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, so let's have a look at the exactly. You know, let's go in the inside and check out the gallery. Yeah, yeah, we have everything here. We have a bookstore, we have mm. a gallery. We are just uh, a creative space that is basically uh, that is based on on creativity in mm. art and literature. So, can you tell us about the paintings? Who paints these paintings? Exactly. And uh, are they for sale if anyone is looking for exactly. buying one of them? Yeah, by creating the art gallery mm. at my last mm. was the way of giving young, talented Rwandans artists yeah. a platform where they can just prove themselves about what they have learned at school. Yeah. So those art paintings are made by Rwandan artists, mm -hmm. young Rwandan artists. Yes. Very proud to say that because yeah. also I'm a young person. Uh -huh. So when you're just seeing someone doing magical things, amazing stuff like those ones, you have yeah. to applaud and appreciate so yes uh, i give them the space they mm -hmm. came here we sell them mm -hmm. and we sell those paintings for them yeah. they get money mm -hmm. they, they just become so courageous why they get something so i'm just trying to create a platform mm -hmm. where they can express themselves express not only themselves. in art yeah art by painting mm. but also in the whole field of art yes yeah when you are a professional young Photographer, you are free to come and show up. You see on my projector there. Yeah. Prove what you're just doing. Yeah. When you are a poet, you have to come up here and say, "I need time. Yeah. I just want to make people feel free to come to this place." Yeah. When you are creative, you are free to mind. Have this. Yes. Uh, this is uh, a calendar made by a, a young photographer. It's a lady called Ruth. Uh huh. Uh, those are pictures she used to make herself. To, oh. to, to show herself and uh, put on them on calendar. Mm. So I'm just trying to show up that this is a space for everyone. Yes. Everyone who is creative, who is so talented, mm. must feel free to come and make yes. it home. Yeah. Paintings are for sale mm. just because we spend money for those paintings. Yeah. So we want to get something as a revenue from what we're just doing. When you yeah. give money mm. for artists, when they paint, they spend, yeah. so they just want to get money from what they're doing. That's when they will never be discouraged and say that my art, my talent is not feeding me. You know? yeah. Some people used to be discouraged. You, know? yeah. Yeah. you will see in basketball players in Rwanda, mm. 
they are working in other fields. Mm. Basketball is now becoming their food, it's an example. Yeah. In arts, that's how people are just living, you understand? Yeah. People are just live what they are very passionate with. Mm. You know, when you are passionate on something, that's where you have to be. But actually right now people are just living what they they feel free to do. Yes. And do on something that can feed them. But when you use those things with a creativity, mm. you have to make sure that not today, but tomorrow it will feed you. Yes, yeah, definitely. Yeah, exactly. yeah that, that should be the plan. That should be the plan. Mm -hmm. Yes. So when maybe I come here and like this painting, mm -hmm. so do I get this one or the, the painter makes another similar no, no, painting? No, 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 you get this one. I get this one. There is no other painting that seems like this one. Mm. You know, this is a painting from heart. Mm. It's a, a meditation art, you understand? Yes. Yeah. It's not like a portrait where you came with your photo, they, they draw, mm. next day they can draw. This is an imagination art someone mm. made yes. for sale. When yeah. you come and feel free to buy this as an African woman, mm. I mean, check it out. This is a definition of Africa, you see. Yeah. It's a young lady with yeah. air, natural air, yeah. that prove who we are here in Africa. Yes. This is our beauty. Yes, that's why definitely. I just told you we get more artful ladies. That's why it's a true definition of who we are here. Yeah. I like no. the I, I like the fact that mm -hmm. looking at all these paintings, yeah. you can easily see uh, blackness yeah, or exactly. Africa. Uh -huh. Yeah, you you can uh, you you immediately see it because you can see they're all um, Afrocentric. So, uh, like this painting. Mm -hmm. Uh, what can you tell us about it? I'm seeing some colors that kind of looks like the Rwandan flag, but exactly. yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> what can you tell us about this painting? Uh, this is a painting that is saying, you see, uh, uh, you, you are wearing graces. You mm -hmm. understand that when you lose something, it seems like eyes, you lost vision, yes. you lost some vision. I yeah. hope you understand what I'm just talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is a young lady from a countryside, mm -hmm. the artwork made by a young man called King. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a it's a, a story that is saying that it's possible mm. for those young ladies from a countryside, for those young ladies that can you know, just make it right now. Mm. This is simply the meaning mm. of every young lady in the countryside, every young man in the countryside mm. who is dreaming to be in Kigali, not being in Kigali as someone who is not variable but mm. being together as someone who is so much important in the society yes that's the, the vision that's the vision but yeah. it should cost her much things yeah. study hard yes uh, discipline persistence yes and keep improving herself for being a better person yeah every yeah. single day exactly. yeah uh, this ah, is this one is, of the art uh, yeah this is actually very deep uh, yes yes yeah. the second one here uh, i can't explain all but mm. i can just shortly give oh. some of the paintings mm -hmm. you see this is a painting that has been made by a young artist called rema mm -hmm. he is very talented so the concept was just sometimes you see young ladies when there is a violence, yeah. they just keep shutting them, uh, their mouth, not, not just give the information of what happened, yeah. not just expressing themselves. Mm -hmm. That comes with a depression, you understand? Yeah. So this is an art piece that is proving to us that even men can just be a voice for those people who are just facing violence. Yes. This is a depression for young ladies. Mm -hmm. Everyone must stand up and give them a space yes to let them talk for what is happening yeah yeah so i, li I like the fact that uh, every every table here has books on it yes has books on it so uh, why did you choose books well, what's the reason behind choosing books on every putting books on every table books is everything uh, so the people who knows the value of wisdom mm -hmm. they found wisdom in books Wisdom in books. Yeah, that's why I before to serve food, I serve books. Mm. And this yeah. is one of the books that, that I like. It's called To Repair the World. Mm. I, I would like to invite every young man mm -hmm. here in Rwanda to read this mm. book. And this is the book that is saying about Martin Luther King Jr. Mm. So we have a different books here. You see, those are books that is saying out of Egypt, mm -hmm. you know. 
every young man when not only young man every yeah. client who came here before getting something uh, must get wisdom this is a space for genius yes it's a space for just encouraging everyone yes to be genius to lead and uh, when you keep leading uh, that's how you will be having a wisdom to share now you know in Rwanda we have uh, a culture Mm. where people don't like to leave. Yeah, they Mostly don't. you can just put money in the book yeah. and it can spend 20 years in the yeah. room or somewhere yeah. never even open it. Yes. So Definitely. when you just want to get something more valuable mm. mm. that we can just, they can help you in the future days to come, you have to keep reading books. Different yes. books, mm. different ideas, that's where you found wisdom and being so most important in society. That's how that's why you are just seeing different books here. This is a book that's saying God does care. Mm. Everyone is welcome. The Christian, yes. Muslim, atheist, mm. everyone is welcome. Yes. And he will get what is just can reach his mental life. Yeah. That is actually very, very yeah. impressive. Yes. Yeah, now, so... Normally, normally in the normal videos, uh, in the in the other videos we did, mm. there is a point where I ask about the specialty of the place. Mm. But trust me, I already know your specialty. Mm. Yeah, this place is special itself. Yeah, thank you so much. Yes, I appreciate. I yes. appreciate. And I'm just welcoming everyone to come. Before you have food, you have. Food. Yes. So to the people who might be watching, mm. how can you? Uh, uh, direct them to Ngawa Corner. Ngawa Corner actually is located in Kiyofu. Mm -hmm. uh, and 16, if 19, uh, it's an opposite side to Nobilis Hotel. Yes. Uh, Nobilis Hotel is a uh, known space in Kiyofu. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for your time. Yes. This was really very insightful and interesting. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, you can uh, say anything you want to the viewers in case yes. you have uh, something to say. Just welcome you feel at home mm. when you are creative you are not yes come the more you read books the more you get knowledge the more you get something that can change your mind and mm. how you see things give you other overview of how you, you can live in this world yes the more you read about books that is saying about god the more you become so connected to mm. the author the yes. author is god himself the more you just Need the book for how to repair the world, the more it becomes so kind, gentle. Uh, yes, you know that living with people is the most important. Yeah, uh, thank you so much, and I appreciate for having your time here at such Rwanda. Yeah. And hopefully, day by day, the more I grow up, the more, the more you grow up. Thank you uh, so much. Thank you for coming. Thank you so much. Yeah, so this was King from Inga Wokona, and I am your host, Alain Kamanda from Search Rwanda. Thank you so much.